everybody. Long time no see. It has been a long time. Um, I've changed my look quite a bit. I used to have the pink hair and I had the gray hair. Gray old lady hair. Lately I've been doing a makeup vlog and um, I've also been trying to do some videos. But I wanted to get a better camera first before I did. So now I'm back because I have a nice, a really nice camera. She's 1080p. Um, I was doing just review videos. Um, but now I decided I might as well try my hand at makeup videos. Um, I'm not a makeup artist. I'm not a professional in any way, I'm just your standard consumer. But, um, you know, I do like to experiment a lot. I do get a lot of people asking me on the street, like, about the makeup all the time. So I thought I might as well just show the looks that I do on my own at home, whenever I'm out going out during the days and stuff like that. And um, show it to you guys and maybe it'll inspire you guys to make something similar or the same or whatever. So, all the makeup I'll be using today is Sugar Pill. Little package looks like these. Um, this is one of their palettes, which I'll be showing you in a little bit. Um, absolutely love this company. Um, brand new company, just started out. Um, it's a friend of a friend who started it. So I decided to try it out and I've been in love with it ever since. Um, it's the only makeup I've been using, actually. I'm also only just expanding my makeup collection, so you'll have to excuse me for only using one brand, but might as well use a really good one, which is what this is. So, to see how to do this look, it's really easy. Go ahead and stay tuned. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put on my, I have my little eyeshadow base. It's a NYX. Looks like this. I'm just going to use a brush. Nothing fancy for it. And I'm just going to apply it to my eye. Then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to like blend it with the brush, just make sure everything's all blended out. Alright, I'm going to take my red, which is from my Sugar Pill, um, it's Burning Hearts palette. Looks like this. So I'm going to take the red one. And apply it to the very corner, kind of like a wing. So, like that. Then I'm going to take my pink, which is Decora by Sugar Pill. Looks like that. And I'm going to apply it like right along here. Also open to the crease a little bit. So like that. I'm gonna use my little angle brush. And I'm gonna put some more of the pink on it. And I'll apply it um, for a little bit more detail in the crease and right underneath. like that. I'm also going to take a little bit more of that red again and I'm going to put that in the crease again. Just get a little bit more definition. I like that. I'm also going to put it into the very corner of my bottom lid there. So, looks like that. Then I'm going to go ahead and do some blending. Just try to blend everything together really nice. So, like that. I'm going to take some white. Um, this is also sugar pill again. It's the white. It's called Taco. I'm going to apply that right into the corner of my eye and also above everything. Down like that. And then my angle brush again. And I'm going to apply a little bit of gold. Oops. 
let's drop my lid. So I'm just going to apply it like right in here in the very corner and then underneath in the very corner. So, I don't know if you can really see it though. Then what I also like to do is, um, since I don't have any black eyeliner, I like to take a little bit of black shadow and um, take an angle brush again and I just apply it right into like kind of like a wing all the way under and I kind of blend that in as well. So that would make my eyeliner look a little bit darker than it is. And the reason I don't ever use black eyeliner is just because I think it's too harsh. Um, also because I have liquid liner and liquid liner is like really harsh on its own. So having it in, I like it, I prefer it in brown. I think it looks better. So let's see. So I'm going to apply a little bit of a wing. So I don't know if you can really see it. Now I'm going to apply some eyeliner. For me, I just use Maybelline, just store brand liquid liner. And I just apply it on the top. I don't do it on the bottom at all. Again, I think it's too harsh. But I do like to apply a white pencil into the lower lid. Then, I'm going to take my mascara. Um, normally, I would do false lashes or something like this. Um, but it looks like this outside. Yeah, so I'm not going anywhere tonight. <laughs> so, I'll just plain black mascara I'll just have to do. So what I have here is I have a nice little pink blush. Um, it's by Femme Couture. It's a mineral blush. Sorry, can't talk tonight. And uh, just back from your local local um, beauty supply store. Just take a good portion of it. My brush, my big brush. Just doing the apples, cheeks, like that. And of course, you can find those by like smiling a little, like that. And I also like to apply just a dab on my nose, so, like that. And I have a brow pencil in just a blonde color, and I'll put that in, like so. And lastly, you can apply it like your favorite pink lipstick. Um, the one I'm using is Melange by OCC Cosmetics. This is one I've actually reviewed for before. Um, it's kind of a nice taupe color. I don't know if you can see that, but you'll see it in a minute anyway. So take a lip brush, and with this stuff you always need a lip brush, because um, it's really, really pigmented, and it would be ridiculous to try to do it like this. I get everywhere. There you go. So, there's my little Valentine's Day look. Um, you know, give me your comments. Let me know how you feel about it. Um, also, give me any suggestions if you're looking for, any, for me to show you anything particular. And otherwise, I will see you next time. Bye.